Welcome to my second channel. Hey, hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to my second channel. And as you can tell by the title, I am about to do my very first video on a DIY and I've been sitting here back to back to back watching YouTube videos about how to make easy stack leggings. And I'm telling y'all, I love me some stack leggings and BTW stack leggings are now being added to the Mocha Princess collection. If you haven't already went ahead and got you a Mocha Princess necklace, cap, two piece sets, and of course our Mocha Princess bonnets. So make sure y'all go ahead and get that. But um, I'm about to show y'all how to get some stack leggings. So we're gonna try to make, no, we're, we're gonna succeed. We're going to succeed at making some stack leggings for under $10. So I had already went to Walmart, y'all. And I got me two pairs of leggings for the kinds that they had available. And I really, um, I haven't even tried these on yet, but they're medium. Um, I got me a medium. I don't know if y'all can see. I got me a medium and it costs $5.96. It costs $5.96 and I got two pairs of these. So, yes. So, I'm going to try these on to show y'all what they look like on me. And then we're going to go ahead and start cutting it up, dudding it up, period. Okay, so um, I wanted to get something that was nice material, um, cute different colors, and I'm actually, this is my first trial one, and then I actually got like different colors that I wanna do later. Anyway, the material is really stretchy or whatever. If we go to the bottom, I've seen a few people who would wear them and cut off any excess stuff, and then I've seen a few ladies who actually just cut off this little trim part right here at the bottom if you can kind of see it so that way it would be like an easy transition so what i'm gonna do because i'm scared to do the other way i'm just gonna cut off this little block piece that's right here if y'all can see it y'all see that i'm gonna go ahead and cut off this little block block piece on all of the bottoms of the pan um make sure y'all get y'all some really good um scissors Okay, so right now I'm lining up both of the leggings to match them up perfectly and right about in the middle of the thigh area, I'm going to go ahead and cut straight across because um, you want to line it up where you have like the bottom piece is what's going to be the stack part of the leggings. And I'm going to show you in a minute once I cut it so you can see this excess part is the part that's actually going to be the stack part. So this piece right here is the part that's gonna be all stacked up at the bottom that we're gonna sew together. And so just to match it up, um, I went ahead and just folded the other side that I cut on top of the other side, if that makes any sense. Look at the video, y'all. Just stick with me, stick with me. And then I just cut it so it can be even because you don't want them to be uneven or you're gonna have one leg swooping down to the ground. And um, actually, um, you can make these shorter, longer. It's all up to you. But now I got me an extra pair of shorts body fitted shorts so that's lit all right so now i am taking the piece um that we cut and turning it inside out so that way i can match it on top of the leggings that um we're going to be connecting it with so right now i'm opening it up and i'm sliding it onto the um leggings so that way they can match up and i want the seam and seam to be intact and then at the very bottom that's where we're going to um, match it up so that way that way it's perfect Okay, so now I have my little push pins. I don't know what these are called, but I'm just calling them push pins. They push, they pins. And right now, I'm just weaving them in and out around the rim of the bottom of the leggings to keep them in the same place because I want them perfectly matched up so when I sew it, one, it can be an easy transition and you won't be able to really see it as much. But this is my first time sewing, so please don't judge me. But you get the idea. And it's supposed to look like this completely around to make sure that everything is lined up perfectly because you don't want it to be uneven. And then I'm gonna go ahead and take that and put it on my sewing machine. And um, I keep the, the little tacks in there, and then I'm just gonna sew it around in a circle. I'm using my Sing Sinclair, um, Sinclair, Sinclair <laughs> um, sewing machine. So yes, just slide it on in there, 
and I just put it down, sew it, and then um, do a back stitch if you want to. Um, I use the regular stitching, which is like the straight one. I didn't do the zigzag one that a lot of people in other videos said to use because I honestly didn't know how to do it. And like, I told y'all this is my first time. But yeah, I just lined it up, put the thing down, uh, watched a couple YouTube videos to figure out how to get it started, and I just went straight across. Um, I held it really tight to make sure that I didn't go too far up and that I didn't go to the bottom like all the way to the bottom and I just went around in the complete circle for both of the leggings. Okay, so now this is what the pants look like completely. So I'm just gonna go ahead and unravel them so that way you guys can see the transition. And they look really long like the SpongeBob episode when he went to um, prom with Pearl. But um, I really liked how these came out. I was a little scared because like I said, this is my first time sewing something together. I was just up late and I said, let me try something new. But when you put them on, they look really cute. Like, so now when I put them on, I want y'all to see like they are long, but that's what makes them, that's the stack part. You know, thick thighs save lives. Don't judge me, you know what I'm saying? And um. Um, they're really cute I like these and again these are under $10 so you guys if you want to see more videos and how these turned out look at them and I'm gonna get up close and personal so you can see how they look up close you can't even tell and if you can tell you can just pull it over the stack part but like comment subscribe turn on your post notification hit that thumbs up button comment down below if you want to see more videos and me try different DIYs if you want to see me do different colors or different stuff that you would like me to try I'm not perfect but I'm trying and I love you guys and I'm out peace